Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. I'm Neve, and today I'm going to be attempting to turn this lazy elf jacket into a skirt to match this lazy elf jacket. Now, you may be thinking, girl, why do you have two of the same jackets? And first of all, they're not quite the same. This one I got at the London sample sale because I really wanted this jacket. And then this one I found at the Manchester sample sale and it is an actual sample as the daisies have the iconic lazy elf bare face in them instead of just a smiley face and the manchester one is actually a bit more cropped and boxy than this one so that's how i ended up with two however i definitely don't need two but i do love both so i decided why not chance my luck absolutely destroying this jacket and hoping i can make it in to a skirt i'm gonna use this one since i thought it make more sense to destroy the mass produced one than the actual sample one big brain things am i right and then i can just have a cute coordinating matching moment for summer since summer is here ladies well you know technically i'm irish so summer isn't officially here until june 21st and it is literally raining right now so we're just getting prepared early you know so i have a plan of what i think i need to do but I am trying to keep expectations low just in case. But I'm thinking I will start by just detaching, removing, seam ripping the bottom hem from this jacket. And then I will probably seam rip up along here across the front and then all the way across the back. I'll be left then with this piece, which I'm planning to use for the skirt. Alrighty, so here is my vision for the skirt. Like I said, I'm gonna seam rip this hemline and then just move it up here and actually use it as the waistband for my skirt. And I will also seam rip along this seam and that will create the base of my skirt. I will also obviously need to fix the back and I'll probably have to detach the sleeves and stitch up the armhole. But both of those things are kind of a problem for later. Right now I'm just gonna focus on seam ripping down here and up here. So let's start seam ripping. Seam rip, seam rip, everybody seam rip. So a pretty small inconvenience, I guess, that I ran into was that twice there were daisies on the track of the seams I was cutting, which turned out to not really be a problem at all as I was just able to cut around them on the denim and it worked totally fine as they weren't in a crucial position or anything like that. So it turned out to really not be a problem at all. Progress report, I have deconstructed the jacket. Um, a problem that I thought I was gonna run into while cutting the seams but conveniently didn't was I thought I was gonna lose the position of these fake pocket flaps and I'd have to align them back up with this button. However, as we see here, there was a row of stitches to keep them in place so that actually worked out perfect. And now we have the skirt piece, detach, detach, and I also busted open both side seams and then this is gonna be our beautiful skirt well i hope it's gonna be beautiful so the plan now is to basically take this skirt that i like the fit of and basically just use it as a pattern piece get some chalk some pins mark out the skirt obviously the skirt they're not a perfect match so my skirt won't have as much flair as the skirt but i think it should still work decently well so i'm gonna mark it pin it try it on and either sew from there or remark repin we shall see Not sure why I didn't just speak here, but basically I was happy with this side of the skirt, but not too happy with this side as it was quite lumpy. I also just have the waistband tied around my waist to see how it will look. Here it is after I tweaked it, and to be honest, did I even do anything? But there it is. Okay, here is the shape of the skirt I ended up going for. At this point, I've kind of abandoned the shape of the skirt. It just wasn't really working with the flare. And this is what I've come up with. I'll flip it inside out so you can truly see. But I think like this, this is a skirt, is it not? Okay, here it is flipped inside out. It has been stitched, but this is just a temporary stitch. But this is kind of the shape I went at the waist and then going out a bit to allow for hips. And then kind of just going straight down because I was limited with the corner down here and the same on the other side it goes out a bit and then just more straight and I think this is good but more importantly it's as good as we're gonna get so I'm gonna stick with this I think now hmm what's my move now now I'm just gonna properly stitch the sides which is kind of daunting but it's the correct next step once the sides are properly stitched I will then be taking our waist 
slash hemline obviously first of all this button is upside down but that's because this is conveniently done for me already and if i want the button the right way i'll have to bust open this side and close this side which is a lot of work so i don't mind that's upside down and opening the opposite way i will just open it and insert the skirt inside sandwich that together all the way around the top of the skirt pin it and then just stitch along this line and that will be the waistband which i think looks pretty good happy with that element of the skirt and unfortunately after pinning the waistband onto the skirt i ran into a bit of an issue and the issue was the button did not functionally close which that's on my engineering brain for not realizing that but now we're gonna have to fix that unfortunately i was unable to just open the closed side and close the open side as they're totally different so i needed another plan okay, i think my solution is gonna have to be button side i've turned it inside out so now this buttonhole will align with all the other buttonholes can stitch that on just fine then the button side i think i'm gonna have to cut the button piece off then i'll be left with this square of button which i can turn the right way around close this side open this side and attach here and line it up when i attach the button square back to this piece i can make it shorter which i need to do anyways and then attach it back on so that button piece will be the right way around but then oops the rest of it will still be open on this side i can attach it to the skirt but just only turn this piece around i think that is the best solution for right now Guys, the waistband is attached, and dare I say, it looks pretty promising. I'm pretty excited, so let's try this baby on. Like, that's a skirt. Stop it. I did that, and I even got the button the right way around. I am once again asking the audience, is this or is this not a skirt? yay yeah i have some beef with the skirt number one i think it would help to have some little poppers in between the buttons just to keep it from gaping as much now you may say girl it's too small if it's gaping i say it just doesn't have a popper however i don't have any poppers so i'm gonna have to leave that for now not the biggest deal but just minor things in the mirror i feel like this crease wasn't as obvious but it looks pretty obvious on camera probably gonna ignore that the sides are a little bit bumpy down here but that is mainly just because of the pockets and i don't want to sew the pockets up because i think they're cute like who doesn't want tiny pockets so i think i'm just gonna ignore that issue also is there a theme of ignoring issues yes there is but hey guys this is a skirt also i don't know what i'm gonna do with the hem obviously it's raw i'm not sure if that will look strange with the jacket since the jacket has like a finished hem so i may hem this not sure like it's not the shortest skirt so i have space to hem it like that so i'm not sure if i want to i don't know which you think looks better hemmed or not hemmed decisions decisions anyway this is the skirt i'm pretty happy with it and now i think i'm gonna go frolic in the garden now here i am pulling any random pose i can think of with a corresponding daisy tote you also see what i mean by how little snappers would make the skirt sit just a tiny bit better and then i show the skirt with the jacket the full fit i think it's very cute i'm very happy with how this turned out i mean yes if i look at it too long it starts to look a bit weird but i do think she's cute overall and i'm so glad i found a new purpose for my duplicate jacket and that is everything thank you so much for watching this video and checking out my channel i hope you enjoyed please subscribe if you would like and i'll see you next time goodbye can't forget the dog's nose boop though